Geese might be known for staring down oncoming traffic, brawling with pedestrians, and even defeating gorillas in single combat. But they aren't just fighters, they're lovers too, with a penchant for bi throuples. Enter Thomas the Goose. Thomas was a domestic white goose in New Zealand who made a name for himself in the early 90s when he bonded with a black swan named Henrietta. They spent an absurd 24 years together before a female swan joined them to form a love triangle. The new swan soon laid an egg, but the signet that hatched from it wasn't part goose, it was all swan. Henrietta was actually a male, renamed Henry, meaning that Thomas had been in a same-sex bond for about a quarter century. Thomas helped raise nearly 70 young swans from his partners, and when Henry died, Thomas bonded with a female goose and had 10 goslings of his own. By the time Thomas died in 2018, at almost 40 years old, he was a world-famous blind bi goose. His death was covered by the BBC, and his funeral was attended by about 60 people, complete with a full procession and a bagpipe player. He was buried next to Henry. But as sensational as Thomas became, he actually wasn't that unusual. Bisexuality is quite common among birds. There are more than 130 bird species with documented bi behavior. A 2006 study of 80 bird species found that same-sex behavior occurred in every single one, and in 31 of them, it wasn't rare. Researchers believe that bisexuality in birds helped form social alliances and share resources, which makes perfect sense. It turns out there's a good reason why bi-birds of a feather flock together.